I, I kind of faintly re recall this. Please, let's through. Let my daughter go right now. She's a thief, hell spawn. And you will wait for Korga's judgment. Now get back. Oh, let me through, Radrashem, or I'll rip your damn throat out. <gasps> We need to get Arabella out, now! You heard the guards. They're waiting on Corker to give word. I'd sooner trek through the Nine Hells than trust that snake! Ugh. Arabella tried to steal their idol. Druids lost their damn minds about it. They need it for their precious ritual. Oh, it's all my fault. I told her I wished the wretched thing would just disappear, or better yet, explode. Now Arabella's being judged by a bunch of druids who hate us. That's not right. This grove is like a cauldron about to boil over. I say we check in on the child, make sure she comes to no harm. Thank you. They won't give us the time of day. Hurry! I'm at the end of my tether as is. Can't take this waiting! Do all the damn rituals you want! We're not leaving till it's safe! Damn it! We could have taken those guards. Carl <sighs> Magrin, give her a chance. You, step back! We'll not tolerate drow in here. Okay, Castle raises him. Keep back! Force my hand and I'll show you its claws. A moment, Giona. What? Why would she allow one of them? I... I suppose so. You! Apparently Korga wants to see you. Go ahead, but a word of warning. One wrong move and every single animal here will tear you apart. Nice. Okay, so they are casting some kind of spell here. I don't know what's happening. Okay, there's a shop. I need a quick word. A cool Do my eyes deceive me? A drow! Here! Forgive my surprise. It's rare to find your kind above ground. Rare and intriguing on a day already packed with intrigue. You were at the gates just now, no? When the goblins came, you saw them up close? A few questions, if you please. There's no overstating my interest. Glory. Now then, how would you describe that particular batch of goblins? Size, nature, distinguishing qualities. Small, smelly. Set your mind successfully recalling various details of goblin behavior. Goblins were of a rare gem-colored hue and wielded magic blowguns. Uh, I don't think it went that way. This man has no respect for truth. And the dragon they had marching in the rear, was it of the brass or silver variety? The truth, my friend. Not a jot, more or less. Last question, then you'll be quite free. Did the attackers rally to the absolute when they fell upon the gates? Really? Well, this does complicate things. But then again, well, never mind. I've interrogated one, a captive in this very camp. She reports they've abandoned their god, Maglaviet, in favor of someone called the Absolute. The scandal! Ah. Ah, but is superstition all? These goblins are informed by a kind of strategy anathema to their kind. I, for one, Intend to get to the bottom of it. I'm just preparing to head to their camp as we speak, in fact. Uh, okay, that's a bad idea. Control. 
my friend. Every story benefits from a dragon. Oh well. Until sure. Okay. Bards and their stories. Always room for more. Yeah, I suppose they don't mind if I take their plants. Let's see. By Sylvanas, the forest father, we are granted balance. One I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Have you lost your senses, Koga? Release her. She stole the idol of Sylvanus. She must pay the price. We will imprison the thief under guard of my servant. Please. I'm sorry. This is madness, Korga. She's just a... A what, Wrath? A thief? A poison? A threat? I will imprison the devil. And I will cast out every stranger. Girl, you mean parasite. She eats our food, drinks our water, then steals our most holy idol in thanks. Wrath, lock her up. She remains here until the rite is complete. And keep still, devil. Teela is restless. Come, Koga. We took back the idol. Surely... Do it. Hmm. You could try to read, read her mind. But that, that worked pretty, pretty well. That was difficult. Halsin is gone. I am first druid now. I will take control and prove my authority. Ah. Yeah, prove your authority, no prove your Fair mercy. Words. Child. Leather disapproves. Word of my grace. Sif, Sif, Tila, to me. <laughs> it hurts. Thank you, Korga. Master Holson. What? Isn't here. What hurt? Keep his name off your tongue, lest Tila pierce it. Ah. I know that look. You're wondering why I was in pain before. Let's just clear the air about that now. It's just an old wound that hurts me from time to time. Nothing to be concerned about. It's nothing Seem, to seemed do with like magical. Tables, at least, in case your imagination is in danger of getting away from you. It's just something I have to live with. Quite a lot. If I'm being honest. But it always passes quickly, so I can manage. There's no story. None that you're entitled to hear, anyway. Just forget you ever saw it. We've been through quite a lot, with likely more to come. Care to narrow it down a little? I must admit, you've been a surprise, and not an unpleasant one. Kindred spirits are few and far between for me. Besides, you saved my life aboard the Northwood. Yeah, she, she, she'll remember I that, that part of the game. Sing your praises. Must I? Thinking about it won't help. We know what to do, so let's do it. 
find a way to rid ourselves of these things. Personally, I think finding this Halsin is yeah, the best. Yeah, that, that, that would be uh, my, my choice. We can try to convince that goblin gut in assisting us. I'm not too hopeful that a gith crash will actually prove our salvation, but worth keeping in mind. That woman has more venom in her heart than a <laughs> yeah. snake in its fangs. But at least the child is safe. What is youth if not a time to be forgiven for one's transgressions? Couldn't agree more. The girl wasn't innocent, but that doesn't mean she was guilty. By claw and tooth from root to thorn, the old oak's grove to wildlings sworn. Ah. The mural shows druids claiming the grove in the name of the old oak. Old Sylvanus, oak. god of nature. Okay. So, uh, somebody wanted to see us. A deep elf in our grove on this day. A sign, or rather, a gift. Okay. Better to understand a watchful brood mother than a beloved child of loss. Um, uh, I have no love to, for the queen of spiders. Indeed. But you do exhibit a talent for self preservation. A viper bears her fangs defending her brood. Is it not her nature to strike at invaders? No matter. I took back the idol of Sylvanus, and the writers resumed. We will seal the grove, free from harm. Okay, they are free sealing the grove. The right of thorns. It is the Tree Father's gift that none come to harm. When we speak the final prayer, the great vine will sprout forth. The grove will be cloaked in bramble and thorn. No one enters, no one leaves. Sanctuary. Air little own kingdom. Can while outlanders infect us. Sylvanus demands that we choke them out. Uh huh. I am first druid now. I protect the circle, whatever the cost. You showed great metal at the gate. The metal of a skilled sword for hire. I want you to provide your services to the tiefling leader. Zevlor, he's called. Offer to guide the outlanders out of the grove. I'm sure they'll reward you well. They're to be gone before final prayer. If they are not, the viper must strike. Okay. We, we understand, so we need to find the old route. Uh, you will do more than speak. This tale ends but one way. With the Outlander rot cleansed, and the grove forever shrouded. So we need to save the goblin. Okay. The forest rose with claw and tooth to tear the darkness from its roots. Beasts chasing beasts alongside a wild woman. A depiction of some local folktale, perhaps.
you ever scare me like that again, and I'll feed you to a knoll. Mom, I'm fine. Stop it. Our little hellion told us what happened. Thank you. Don't know what we'd do without her. The Nine Hells will sooner freeze over, but we'll try. Wells, it's our job to get us out of here. Okay. Space, not yours. Dancing the lights. It's my job too. The druids don't care about us. No one should not wish to live in more interest. We have times. to look after us. I heard what happened. Thank you for protecting the child. If the druids yeah, are can I take gone, the goblin with it's me? not just goblins we have to fear. So we can risk violence here, or face it for certain on the road. Quite the choice, isn't it? Choices and choices. You saw what they were willing to do to a child just for trying. It's ah. Korga's influence. Without her twisting things, I believe the druids might see sense. A low thought, but I'd be lying if I said I hadn't considered it. But the druids would slaughter us. We'd have to get close to Korga, within striking distance. I can't manage that, but they've already let you pass one. Ah. It doesn't sit well with me, either. But to get these people to safety, there's nothing I won't do. You'd be well rewarded for the risk. But if that won't sway you, there's nothing more to discuss. No, sir. Okay, so we need there's to get the goblin goblins. out. They'll find it. Yes. Of course. used to think the goblins would kill us the second we set foot outside. But after hearing what you did at the gate, well, I still think they'll kill us. But at least we can put up a fight. <laughs> there's optimism and then there's stupid, hun. Plenty of us fell to monsters already. I don't see the rest of us lasting long out there. But if you're so sure we will, why not put a little gold on the line? Excellent! Hmm. And since I ain't one to leave a debt unpaid, that means we're destined to meet in Border's Gate. Looking forward to it. So many ways to die. Who's that another person here? You're the one who helped at the gate. Glad to have another sword. We might need it. Ready to go meet my tribe? Just say the word. We're burning her name across the face of the world, we are. The absolute is gold from the sky, she is. The blessing in the storm and the storm itself. Happily, lead the way. All right. Time to skulk about. Oh, don't want to think about why my eye is itching.
Where did I put that old bucket? Children! Your rescue attempt has been noticed. Choose your next move carefully. Did we succeed? Yes, we did. We did. We did succeed. You are persuasive enough. You and the goblin are free to go. Breathe deep and move. How long yeah. until Roland shows off his thunder wave? Swing and swing and Depends. Now, How many people now. are dumb enough to ask? And again. Swing. Your rescue attempt has been noticed. Okay, so I need to choose your next move carefully. I, I'll, I'll need to talk my way out and to not roll one. So why I can't just roll roll once and be done with it? You are persuasive enough. You and the goblin are free to go. How many times I need to persuade? Rescue attempt has been noticed. Choose your next move carefully. There is one minus one. Roll penny. Critical success. Persuasive enough. That was a really a nice time. Let's try this way. Let's move. Maybe some somebody who can actually. Just sneak here. would be better in this. Seen everything. These tieflings prove fragile. I have a mind to end their misery myself. They make good bait, drawing attention away from us. Judicious advice. How puzzling. Your kind will punish you for consorting with us. My name is Lazelk Chucky, and my kin will understand my need for servants. They will help you, but only if I ask. Never wanted the easy path. Ah, thought I was never gonna get out of there. Yeah, me too. Good to be free again, gotta say. Never break a promise, unless there's something in it for me. I'll introduce you to my whole tribe and put in a good word for you. See you at the camp. Okay, that that worked out well. So next thing is search for you, Lazel. I know they do not. It is my responsibility to cleanse myself. They pursued the Nautiloid. Perhaps they were trying to free you. A vain notion. I am one of many and will not be a burden to my queen. So, Stay with us. Aye, aye. I, I this, this, this is not us. good. C can you hear us, Ed? You, not a step closer. A strange symbol glows marked on their flesh. 
and something within you stirs in response. Fifty people did do. I'm so so sorry. It's our brother, True Soul Edwin. Something stirs deep within you, hungry and alert. It's taking something you'll never get back. The injured man locks eyes with you. The parasite writhes in your head. Your limbs do not obey. Your minds intertwine. You see his siblings, Andric and Brynna. New recruits. Yours to shepherd. Protect them. Mind the true soul. She will... She... She... <sighs> Edwin! Ed! Please! He's with the Absolute now. He's Absolute. Thank the Absolute. Edwin, our brother, he was chosen, like you. Do you have orders for us? We were reporting to Edwin. Edwin, hmm. What? Are you, are you testing us? A true soul like you has been chosen by the Absolute. You speak with her voice. Your words are her command. She grants you the power to enforce her will. And when the time comes, the true souls, you, will rule. That fellow had a tadpole in his head, and they consider him blessed? Chosen? What madness is this? We were looking for fugitives. Survivors from that ship that crashed farther west of here. But instead of them, Edwin found an oil bear. An angry one. We managed to drag him away, but the beast's claws had already done their work. I told Edwin not to look in that cave. It was filthy with oil bear tracks. What? It killed one of us. It killed Edwin. It's an enemy of the Absolute. You're right, madam. The beast must be destroyed. The cave is just ahead. They spoke of the Absolute. Same as that goblin, Saza. Hmm. Curious. Looks like the Absolute's drawing all sorts to become followers. Impressive, in a way. Yeah. Yes, get got Tavki crush it. The tadpole lets us command the minds of others. An interesting development, but one to be treated with caution. For better or for worse. No, our only cause is to deny it. This power is just another symptom of disease, and every Why is the least actually 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 correct here? Wise counsel, when the temptation calls, keep silent or suffer. Strange power resonates within the corpse. It calls to you. Your limbs move of their own accord. There's something of value, something you mind crave. Why let its host's memories go to waste? The tadpole has absorbed it all. Its experience could nourish you, strengthen you. Strength and vision both both are not really great. Ah. Uh, here goes nothing. Yeah, it's it's fading. Our last inspiration. Your muscles 
loosen. The tadpole breaks free of its deceased host. Your mind is your own again. For now. Okay, it's good, it's going. Nearby. Yeah, apparently they went, went in first. Yeah, th this is this is going to be a massacre. Bit like in uh, Rancor's <laughs> cave in Star Wars. We're both. Bowie Bowie guy. A discredited goblin. That stench. Dead Albert prey, no doubt. Sure, I can do this. The mark glows, but you feel nothing in response. Your lithid power is beyond reach until you rest. Dust. You're right. We can handle this. And and we'll do it for Edwin. Ah, that was nice the first track. Psionix jump. Wow. Okay, that's a beast. We 
critical hit. Enough movement. Okay, so she can't actually move to the tracking distance. Attacking the over cup. Okay, that wasn't really great. Ouch. Come on. Come here. looks from you to his dead mother. A single strike will end his suffering. Yeah, we, we can't kill the cop. I mean, yeah. Get up. You watch speechless as the cub begins to eat his mother. Yeah, that's a nature. The cub has a fighting chance now. That would have just prolonged its misery. Mercy, of course. What am I to do? Tis. 
take you. I've got a long road ahead. Head of the bro broken spear. So this is basically. I wonder if the Gale can do the main thing. thing. Pretty okay, I think. Very well. Supply for the camp, that's always headless in for a skeleton. Surprise. All's well that ends. Not as bad as it could have. Medium armor. She's using medium armor. Yeah, that's stylish enough. Order of nature. Radiant, radiant damage. Worth grabbing. An owlbear egg. These are supposed to be worth a fortune. Still breathing, despite everything. Moving in. Something nice, nice down there. Okay, well, maybe that's one way out of here. sealed this chest wasn't an amateur either speaking saloon and shar Something the matter. Ish. Hey, what's this? Tracks. End of that. Still alive. Crap. So that's progress. Mm. Moving ahead. Rune of the evil. Well, this was more fun when he was screaming. Did some bleeding art show up to save the druid? I'll cut you to pieces. Kill him!
critical hit. Ouch. That was bad start. That this this guy things caught. There, in the grass. You can kill it, can't you? Like you killed the others. There. Can you see it? Just a dumb boar. You're relieved until you see the flash of a dagger. You can try, but first you'll tell me what you know. I saw you on the ship. You're in league with them, aren't you? Those tentacle. Ah! Your mind twists. You're looking out of unfamiliar eyes, prowling dark, busy streets. You try to hold the memory, but it fades to the worm. The light. The fear. <laughs> what was that? What's going on? The worm. Of course. That explains things. Somewhat. And to think. I was ready to decorate the ground with your innards. <laughs> no apologies. Indeed we are. Please, allow me to introduce myself. He's definitely not My a vampire. My name's Astarian. I was in Baldur's Gate when those beasts snatched me. A pleasure. So, do you know anything about these worms? Turn us into... Ha! <laughs> Of course, it'll turn me into a monster. What else did I expect? Although, it hasn't happened yet. If we can find an expert, someone that can control these things, there might still be time. Well, yes, of course. But first things first. Tempting, but your party seems a little uh, crowded right now. I like to have my space. I was ready to go this alone, but maybe sticking with the herd isn't a bad idea. Safety in numbers, after all. And I hate to turn down an invitation. All right. Maybe I'll see you there. Good luck. All right. This way. Scared boar. Can't give up now. 